We have the roll race record for TX2K. It's 237. The record before was 236. So we beat it by a mile per hour with 250 feet less and four cylinders less. So there was no nitrous. No, 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 no nitrous. And that. nobody believes it either. Yeah. It made right under 2,900 at 70 pounds of boost. So on full kill, PSI it can wise, make what you 95. The most we made was 88, which was that race in Texas 2K. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I told Terrence, I said, Terrence, these guys are our friends and they asked me to give them the hit. How do you say? Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> so all my demon guys, cat guys, there's no hate, bro. It just, it's not going to be fair to say it nicely. No disrespect. I grew up racing in the street. I'm the first GTR in the planet that had a perfect light at a quarter mile. We're not shop cars. No, these are our personal cars. Let's make it very clear. I never lost to UGR, ever. Welcome back to another episode of the Street Alpha Podcast. I am your host, Tooks, and we are in New York. We're back home in New York. We had a long weekend in Maryland, and on the way back, we decided to stop by Team Boosted. We have Billy and Caesar. Let's clap it up for How Billy and Caesar. How are you doing, guys? Hi. Thank you for coming by. Thank you. Appreciate I you guys. I know we're try trying to get together for a, a minute, but yeah, right. we finally made it work. Yes, sir. Finally, finally. Right? Yeah. I didn't know if I wanted to say Staten Island or New York. I was Staten, like, ah. Staten Island, New York. The problem is, I just want to explain why we took so long for this meeting was because of uh, the superstar oh, oh. over here. I, okay, no, so no. we can talk about that. Yeah. Yeah. No, yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Mr. Caesar's never available. Right, we were waiting for him. Being busy racing, no? Yes, of Being course. Yes, over. I know. He's been, yeah. yeah. Yes. Busy racing. <laughs> very, very much. Good. So you had a recent event. <clears throat> That's You went to Florida, right? I went to Florida to the trc event right to see our boys down in miami they did uh they were doing good <clears throat> plus i wanted to i recently purchased i got bike fever i recently yeah, purchased uh that. this thing over here so uh world's fastest bike coming next uh no definitely not <laughs> 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 um but i went down there to you know watch my boys race i wanted to go talk to all the bike guys and uh you know now we're here yeah so uh -huh. how was the, how was the event i, I wanted to go but the event was great. Um, the smaller events, personally, I like better only because it's not like a big rush. Listen, the big events are great, too. I'm not saying yeah. one's better than the other. It's just the smaller events, you get to, you know, see all your friends that you haven't seen and, you know, just mingle and, you know, enjoy people's company. You know what right. I'm saying? But um, all in all, it was a great event. I love all the events. I love just the, comp. you know being yeah. competitive you know Definitely. did you guys have any plans or any goals to set at that event i, I personally no. we didn't i just went as a well, well, caesar as a stand buyer no 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 no, the, no. The you guys TRC, are both you guys both were just no, like standby the, the we, trc we, event i just went by myself we never okay. been to that event to the gotcha. trc yeah. event as um, a as a team but to talk about the event we went to fl2k so that was the most that was the last event you guys were at as a yes. team as correct. a team yes. okay so, I thought he was there, like racing. I'm like, oh, okay. Not the TRC, I, right? That's but, what I thought. Uh, FL2K. No, we it was in FL2K, Maryland. That was the last event. I think FL2K was after. After FL2K. Yeah, because when I went after. to Maryland, I was going to no, go to FL2K. He's right. No, it's Maryland. FL2K was in October. Yes. And then Maryland was. That was. Yes. Oh, yes. Last year, right, yeah. Yes. The yeah, last close, event that close. we went. Okay. With my car. You know, that's a, like, like I was saying, that's an NHRA event. Right. Where you have to have your car. Yes, import we versus all, domestic. Yes. Right. We took the Hulk only. That's so it. So my car <laughs> is certified with the cage and everything to run 650. Mm -hmm. So we went to try it out over there. That was the F last event. First event. time out, we took that car. Um, no, actually, that was the second time we took that this car. This is the third time we. Third time. Okay, third we time. Went. It was the third time, but it's a new build. You know, um, first time we took it out was import versus domestic last year. We had some catch can issues. Like I said, it was the first time the car was out. Okay. Then we went to FL2K. We had some, I guess, growing pains, you know? Yeah. And with, well, with, with the green car. With, with the green car. The Hulk. The green yes, the Hulk. Right. Yes. Yes. He's got, Caesar's got the turbo kit. That was in the Lambo Assassin in 21 when we won Texas 2K21. That has uh, 76 
85. Uh, 85 precisions. Okay. Mechanical fuel pump, all the, you know, the good stuff. But stock location. You kind of gave me the rundown at uh, at World Cup because yeah. you were talking about the car and what mm-hmm. was done to it. Just so you guys know, I don't think I made it clear that um, Billy has the world's fastest GTR. I don't think I said that on the episode yet. So for those of you guys who are listening and watching, you guys we have can't, to know. Hold on, uh, Tooks. I'm sorry. We yeah. got to watch how we say the world's fastest GTR yeah. because everybody gets sensitive. Roll well, race. Roll race. It's, it's the GTR. fastest car, though. Roll, fastest. Roll race. Roll GTR. racing. Roll racing. We can't yeah. say fastest so GTR. Who has a fa- so, all right. So let's make that clear then. Yes. Because if you're at the track and you're running <clears throat> quarter mile times, right? Yes. Wouldn't mm-hmm. it be the quickest car? Correct. Yeah. So if you're the fastest car, what do you have to run? For, quarter quarter but, mile or, or for, for me now when it comes to quarter mile for me it's nonsense when they say quickest fastest okay quarter mile right is et it doesn't matter mile per hour right so when e- now that's what i'm saying before when i told you yeah. be careful how you word it because everybody's a little touchy feely that everybody's sensitive no it's the quickest <laughs> no it's the fastest bro we're talking about quarter mile yeah and quarter mile is et whether you say quickest, fastest, it the ET is whoever gets there first. Whether it, it's fast, it's faster than the rest of them. So whether it's quickest, I, I can explain fastest, that. right? So, you want to explain? Uh, Go ahead. You can so the quarter miles works, <laughs> but that's me. ET I feel you. and okay. miles an hour, of course. Right. So the when you get there first, mention ET, you become the quickest. But if you get there first. At 150 mile an hour, and I get there a second at 200 mile an hour, but I become the fastest. Right. You're yeah, the no, quickest. you're not fastest. Yes. Bec- no, you're the faster fast. mile per this hour. Is good, I, this that, is a good combo, though. You're not faster. You're not faster. The you, faster mile you have hour, a, yes. I have the faster mile. we're talking mile. about quarter mile and whoever gets there first. There's no such thing as faster because, okay. because you did 300 miles an hour, but you got there in 11 seconds. I Ooh. did. Mm. You, you know, I went... 150 and i got there in five seconds let let us know what you guys think below in the comments i'm really curious to see what you guys think but but that's why to say (laughs) i don't want to keep repeating myself that's why i said be careful what you say fastest quickest this that that's my opinion right about when it comes to you see we're teammates you know we're like brothers but we this you know he we disagree now it's okay no that's fine i mean it's 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 weird hearing it from somebody who actually has the fast Fast. Roll race. I, I gotta be careful. Roll, roll race. race fastest. Yes. So it's like it's 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 humble of you though to yes, say that, uh, you know. So that's pretty I'm, cool. I'm pretty yeah. humble. Roll I mean, race is a big deal now. Yeah. Right. Some people don't even. <clears throat> what's roll yeah. race? Come what's on. roll race? Yeah. What is, but you, you don't race. you don't you do like track racing like you're, you're I racing do, with Dick I do everything, everything that had to do with racing. So what what makes you guys? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if it's roll. <laughs> you're you're for all, everything. We're gonna race. We're gonna race. I'll I'll run you out. Even, so you guys, you guys do street runs at all? You guys are street uh, racing at all? Yes. Yeah. They don't everything. So you're gonna see the Hulk on the street anytime soon or no? no I don't know about I that. I don't know about going that far. <laughs> but I grew up racing in the street. I'm okay. From, I'm from New York, New Jersey. I mean, come on. If you grew up here, you have to do it. At right. Some point. Listen, the older you get too, right? You have more yeah. responsibilities. You have a lot more to lose. You know. So that's true. That's is true. it smart yeah. street racing in Mexico? You know, one of Mexico the, is far away too. So one of yeah. the biggest. You got to think about that. No, I, <laughs> the we, travel time. Course. We raced the we raced the street in New York with fifty thousand dollars one time. Really? Yes, I'm one of the guys that raced in the street. That was like 50, 50 BC. When was you, this? You, know? you can raise that. <laughs> you, I was gonna say when was this? <laughs> I, I just not, told not you. too long ago, probably three years ago. You can look it up on YouTube. Fifty thousand dollar race in New York City. That was my oh, white up, GTR there. Up north, yeah. I guess. I wasn't around back that, then. The oh. other car took the light. What car? What car were you uh, running? I was racing another GTR. Oh. Fifty thousand dollar race. We we go to the street. I did also you? went to long, a lot of races. We done a lot of races. So did you win that one? I was supposedly won it. I didn't get paid. <sighs> Damn. Okay. If well, we, <laughs> we 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 agree on a race that. If you leave before the light, yeah, you no matter what happened, you automatically lost. Right, right, right. The guy left before the light. He told me, "Oh, you chased me." That does not matter if I chase you or what. So we made up the uh, rules before. We right? made the rules before. Chase, typically, chase is a race. I but only whoever only, leaves yeah. without the light, no matter what it's happens, you like lost the track. Right, and right? exactly. You left yeah. Without yeah. It. you light, leave yeah. on red, yeah. whether I win that's or it. I lose. That's right. that's what we 
that was think, the agreement i think chases or races only off the hands though technically right usually because if you're roll racing you're doing you're not doing off the light if you're off the light i feel like well, that's this, part of the step also he's talking about drag racing now well, I'm, no, you're talking about street racing, no? Yeah, street, street racing, racing, but drag yeah, racing. Yeah. In the street. Right, but yeah. if you're if you're off the light in the street, yeah, I'm saying because you know before yeah. they bring the hands yeah. down, this was with a light, a flashlight. The flashlight goes on. That's it. You go. If you left without, it doesn't matter what you yeah. did. That's right. what we agreed. That on. was the rule for that. Yeah. And that's the stipulation, yeah, right. stipulation, right? After that, I said, <clears throat> listen, this is. So, so you're it, done with street racing after I, that? I said I'm done with it. You know, I just gonna go out there and and have trouble. Listen, like, we yeah. go out, play around with each other. Yeah. You know, like pause. Yeah, oof, yeah. We go out. <laughs> yeah. We got. You know, we race each other. But <laughs> every time that you involve money into a race, it's it's a problem. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. So like, you know, and then we started racing the horsepowers on this car. Now they are at a point that you don't want to take the chance in the street. You know? Yeah, yeah. This car, it's. But like I was I, trying to I say like before, we, we, you know, we take the <laughs> sorry, cars out sorry. and we race each other a little bit, have some fun. Yeah. But to actually go race competitively and for money, that's just it just. No, not you, you've seen what happened in the past. You know what I mean? People go mm -hmm. race. You know, there's uh, they're fighting. There's guns yeah. and shit. We're not we're not yeah. about that. We yeah. just want to go have fun. Right. Yeah. Enjoy the sport. Um and listen, you want to go race? Just let's rent the track. Let's go. There's now there's tracks that you want a prep track. You want an unprep track? Just we could go race there. It's okay. Yeah. yeah. Everybody has money. We could chip in, rent the track, and go run. That's there's no, true. No need to do it in the street and go. You know, hurt somebody. Let's yeah. say you know you want to go do it in the street. You're an idiot, right? You want to go kill yourself, but now you got to go take somebody with you. That's that's fucked up. So yeah. that's my take on street racing. Yeah. It's, okay. But that's 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 a fair that's a fair take. Yeah, but that's that's me now. You know what I'm saying? Right. I'm. Um, You're the world's fastest GTR. Yeah. Uh, oh, again? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah. I'm just trolling you at this point. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, I, I think it's just sad that because like a lot of people who get on the podcast who are like who've been doing this for a long time, yeah. they they always say the same thing. Like it's like, oh, I didn't get paid. So. Yeah. But how long, you've been so doing? You've been racing for a while, so you're gonna go do it for what? To go yeah. to prove what? What are you proving? You're gonna go yeah. okay. Let's say you do it for the pot, right? You know, like you said, fifty grand, twenty grand, whatever it is. Yeah. You're gonna go do it for the pot, but then most of the time you don't get paid. So you're gonna go and arguments, risking everything arguments, arguments. for mm -hmm. what? To go till four in the morning. Know, to go pick some. <laughs> no, to all, go pick a fight with all someone the, all night. All, all night. night. Five in the morning, six. Yeah. I mean, you stand there. Come on, this is not not. Nah. This is, it's not, for it. me, it's not fun. Nah, you know? it's not fun, no. no. Not anymore. So how'd you guys get your start into, into cause, so you didn't street race ever? <clears throat> not really? really. Okay. Yeah, I mean, when I was a kid, we used to go to English town, you know, mess around over there. Um, but street race really, again, I used to fuck around with my friends, but I wasn't mm -hmm. really, oh, I'm going to go race Tooks or I'm going to go race Caesar. Right. You know, amongst right. our group, group, of friends. group of friends, we right. used to go fuck around the street, but actually not like he used to do it like you know i did it all i did, it all. Like, you did everything so, yeah, I yeah. Did it all. so what what was your um how'd you guys get into into all this like what started the passion for cars for the both of you i Are so you I would, hondas or nissans we, yeah we i mean my my group of friends had uh two jay-z's uh the nissan 300 uh oh, wow. that mustangs camaros we had a whole array of of cars then <laughs> You know, I got older, I started my company, so I'm like, all right, time to get serious. We gotta make some money because this shit's getting expensive. Plus, mm -hmm. you know, we gotta have some sort of future for ourselves. So I did that. I was out of it for probably, I don't know, 15 years. Then Caesar and my the whole boosted team took me to the Poconos. I says, Bro, I gotta come. I'm gonna come. But you guys gotta give me a car. I gotta race something. You know, I'm not gonna come and watch. Uh, give me the slowest car, anything. Yeah. So I get we go to the Poconos. I take my cousin Yanni's car, the silver GTR. Mm -hmm. And that was the slowest one out of the pack. So I get it. You know, I go up and down the track. My cousin's very anal, you know, very uh, the temperature, the this, the that. I'm like, okay. bro, we we bought this thing to go race. Everybody else is going up and down the track a hundred times, you, you know, with built mm -hmm. race cars. And you're worried about this fucking F FBO thing, you know? <laughs> So I got a little upset with my cousin. So I says, "Fuck this! I don't want. I don't want to drive your car." So somebody, actually Manny, uh, Manny, what's up? Seven twenty, Manny. He's like, it wasn't even his car. Yeah. He gave me the car. I was running up and down. You know, I'm like, oh, now this shit's fun. So on the way back, 
I bought my cousin Demo's car from Empire Car Wash, which is the black one that I have today. Okay. So that's how I got into it. Um, then we went to Mac from uh, Command, and it was just, you know, just turned into every event. Upgrade, 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 upgrade. That, that's why, like, it's just, it never left the shop. Not because they're not good. It's because Billy just wants always. to go faster, and it was never enough. So that's how that's how you got your that's how i got into it so this seems pretty recent though no was it uh i bought the car five years ago five years ago five years ago so we got heavy into it probably like three four years ago like you know actually you know building building like something stupid you know so did you know did you know exactly what to look for with gtrs or did you care about the certain years or were you just looking for a gtr period i was looking for no i had no idea what i just Demo's car at the time made a thousand horsepower. This is perfect. This is good for me. I'll buy, <laughs> I'll buy this one and and that was the fastest car at the time you've ever been in. The first, that, yes. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, so on the way, so I bought the car and on the way from Connecticut, we make a hit by uh, Newark Airport and we blow the turbo. I'm like, this is great luck. Wow. Yeah. So that's what started the uh, the build. That, yeah. The that's how we went back. You know, we went back to Mac and we went to Elite, the Elite, Elite Turbos, whatever those were. So we went to those, then from those to the Alpha 16s and the ETS 1700s, ETS 1900s. Then from there we went to, oh, then we went to Tony from T1. Mm-hmm. We went 76, 75s. <laughs> there was 76 75 a lot of numbers getting thrown yeah. yes <laughs> and i bought the first setup that came from t1 was 76 75s with um maurice's motor maurice okay. uh with the the matt uh gray t1 drag car okay so i bought his motor it was uh a 38 we went to the poconos and we did i believe 217 218 217 217 yes yeah. yeah, the record at the time was 218. So we went 217. Then we we're going to go again. And there was some, um, I don't know, I think we had like a catch can, some sort of issue. It wasn't, I, I, we were ready, the car was ready to go again. And I'm like, guys, when I told Terrence, we're not running this car because I didn't feel I was, the car was comfortable and mm-hmm. I don't want nobody getting hurt. And, you know. So can you talk about who Terrence is? <clears throat> Terrence, Terrence is. Mr. Cox on Instagram, he actually built the car. Uh, he worked for T1. He built the car. Super nice guy. Mm-hmm. Uh, the whole T1 crew is the best, starting from Tony. Super humble. Just good people, you know? They just explain everything, everything to you. Everything in detail. You know what I'm saying? Like, and at the, guys, end yeah. of the, uh, at the end of the day, that's how it should be. Because you're spending your money. You ask somebody a question, they should be they should tell you, yeah, it made 50 pounds of boost. Or not if you ask them, how much, uh, how much boost did it make? All of it. Honestly, what the fuck does that mean? All of it. Did it make 50, 60, 100? What did it make? You know? What's all of it? Have uh, you had have you had that experience though where you've been to a shop with the amount of money you spent? Off the on record, cars? yes. Okay. Well, actually, we can't be off the record. We're on camera. But yeah. Yeah, I have been, yeah. Um that's why I loved dealing with Tony. Super humble, super professional. They tell you it's gonna be ready. It's gonna be ready. It's not gonna be ready. Of course shit happens, right? right. Um, but I'll call you on Friday. You get a call on Friday. You don't have to call on Thursday and say, yo, what's going on? Do you think it's worse at your level though <clears throat> with the amount of money you're spending? Or do you think it's worse for people who aren't, who don't have a name or haven't proved themselves? Like, let's say if I went to a shop and I just want to put on some basic full bolt on stuff, you think a shop would treat me the same way they're treating you? I, I honestly think it's at the shop. It's, okay. uh, it's up to the shop because exactly. if they, right, right or wrong. Yeah. Right? I mean, it, like, it's how, how you run your business. Like all, I mean, a business you yes, run professionally. You know, right. Felix is a small, Felix Medina, Felix, Tunes, mm-hmm. that, shop. He, yeah. he's a smaller shop, right? right? And most of our cars are built by Felix. Super nice guy. Super humble. I think it's personality. Honestly, personality. it's personality and it's the way you want to, you know, conduct business. Listen, you have to be like that, bro. You got to be humble on the way up is you know you could shit on everyone but you you ain't staying up there <laughs> yeah, you know long. and it's yeah. nasty yeah you know nice. you know who i'm talking about it's nasty when you're on the way down bro it's it's <laughs> and that's why that's why that is there's all that heat you got to yeah. stay humble you got to stay nice you got to show respect whether you're the fastest or the slowest yeah 
you know everybody thanks me all the time oh you're so nice you're so this no that's just me bro like yeah. you know i was i said the same thing you're faster doesn't mean you're better or you're or you got more money it don't it's it's yeah. we're all the same bro you gotta carry yourself where you show respect and you can be respected because if you don't show respect you're not going to be respected yeah you could be the big badass but there's always somebody going to be faster let's right. be honest right races, yeah, okay yes. you know i got you know i got my run now who knows what's going to happen next year yeah, yeah. you know yeah. maybe somebody's going to come and clobber me okay but i showed respect whether i was on top or on the bottom i always show respect you know you have to it's but again that's up to your character your you know mm -hmm. the way you carry yourself what kind of person you are i agree that's that's my take on it you know whether it's right or wrong that's that's the way i think caesar do you feel the same or definitely definitely yeah with me it's a lot longer story how i got into race <laughs> well did you start with hondas or i will say yes yeah but honda and rotary ah I okay remember, so where, where are you from what's your background i'm from the dominican republic okay so you're dominican okay but i got here in the 90s 90s in the 90s so i basically so hold on you're original <clears throat> from dr okay yes sir right. you I didn't know this no i was born in the dominican <laughs> republic in the 90s in in new york corona queens right yeah from there i moved into jersey city you know so if you grew up in the 90s for those people that know there is english town echo racing in Holmes Point, Manhattan, mm -hmm. and 190 Manhattan in the street. Yeah. This is all I did. Bronx. Yeah, this is all I did. So as I was a teenager racing in, at English Town at Echo, I bought me a Mazda RX-7. Mm. That was in in those days. At the time, that was, it a, was, that was the a car that was a shit back then. It was the Supra, the RX-7, uh, the, the Eclipse. The, the Mitsubishi Clean, yeah. so yeah. all these little cars. And I had an RX-7, so. I this is like late 90s though, right? Yeah. Okay, right. I try to beat everybody with my RX-7. So that's what I did. I used to go race in the street. I raced my RX-7 with the, when the Honda were taking up. Yep. We were putting those four cylinder Honda into the 93 Honda Civic. Yeah. They used to go and race with me in my RX-7. <laughs> <laughs> so you, are you familiar, you know Ralphie? Yeah. DRT. So I'm sure yeah. you. I'm, I'm sure you guys have. Did you guys ever race at all back then? Back then, probably we did. Like I said, I not didn't knowing know, probably. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't know him by name, yeah. but I know all these people. I used to. We all used to hang out in 190 Street over there in Manhattan. Yeah. In Holmes Point. So we probably did. They right. probably beat me. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> you see, uh, hold, you see yeah. where humblest comes in? He said he probably beat me. He didn't say I probably beat him. Uh, oh, who knows? Right? Yeah. Who knows? Right. He probably beat me, he said. Yeah. Who but knows? I, That's I, the I was, difference. I was the kid crew. coming from New okay. Jersey to start trolling my hand. <laughs> <laughs> you know? and they, they, they were ready with, with all kinds of shit over there. Yeah. So it was hard to beat them. But anyway, we, we used to meet our English town also, you know? And for me, I took it personal. Mm -hmm. I, I fell in love with this shit. I used to go to uh, to do the bracket racing at English Town almost every season. Yeah. Uh, you know, I was the kid with no money, with the slow car. For you to go and do bracket racing and, and beat the other car, you had to do everything perfect. Like right. If you run 17 seconds, you got to run 17 seconds with a perfect light. Yeah, consistent. In yeah. order to be the other guy. That's what I used to go and do all the time. That's why I, we call Caesar the Grim Reaper at the light. He, yeah, he's really his reaction. Reaction time is crazy, huh? Yes. Well, I, I'm I'm the first GTR in the planet that had a perfect light with my a, car at a quarter mile. Wow! In the GTR with the DCT, yeah, perfect light. We actually with a DTC. The car, the car was um, it's it's uh, Kyle from thirteen twenty has the video. Yeah. So we back then the. The my the black car was at Shop Houston, mm -hmm. and we were up against Shep, the number one qualifier. <laughs> Tell him the story. And Shep is the one that built those the transmissions. Yes, yeah. Back back then, I mean Shep for for every, all of us was yeah. a legend. We're like, mm -hmm. wow, this guy, <laughs> yeah. you know. It had the fast one of the fastest yeah. GTRs back then. So Peter on the mic says, "You better be good at the light because John Shepard chopped you down at the tree." 
you know he was Uh-oh. he was going back and forth you know you know he was amp you know blowing champ up and no disrespect the guy's no joke you know yeah he's, right he cuts yeah. a good light he's a great yeah. driver what yeah, was right. he cutting at, like at that time before he had a not better than caesar <laughs> the time. they tell me get in the car let's see what happened yeah. listen they take it i'm 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 coming from the nine take this strip out of the car let's do it i've been racing my gtr right Way be- did you get a point way, way, way before time? him so you know I'm, I'm i'm used to i'm getting used to my car releasing the pedal the gtr i'm getting used to I'm, I'm doing it a couple of years before i get into his car i get in his car i started saying well the only way i'm going to be that car was running seven six i think we were the, the best he was no, running he, seven eight we yeah, were running was, 780 and he was running 770 770 oh, and the 760 was his best he was his per- personal best personal best wow. so shep ran his personal best at 760, 760. And, and we ran i think a 770 or 780 780, 780. 780. before his his pass you're saying no no on the- with my car right but i'm yeah. saying with his reaction time with this was the reaction right. time and the reaction time was 0.00 i'll show you i'll show you that the video, video. is, is 0.00 0. 0. yeah zero it was a perfect light and it, <laughs> I mean, the we're like, this guy's going to destroy you had us. To, did you guess the light? I did not. I did everything that I was. I did my best. To I don't know what different. he did, but <laughs> it worked. Uh, so remember what I told you. I'm coming from from, from rack and racing right. for me to, to beat him. I had to get a perfect light. That was the only. Yeah, <laughs> the car will not outperform his. No, his no way. He had faster. a faster car. Right. You know, I mean, you understand. So in order for we were heavier to him, too. Okay. I had to take a perfect light, and that's what happened. Wow. It and he ran happened. a good that light, too. It was just this. Yeah. He ran a 0.00. No, zero. So we, with the GTRs, uh, reaction time is very important because of the trans, the Definitely. delay and everything? Definitely. Of course. Right. And they, the they, they, they so comparable to each other. You can build a 2,000 horsepower GTR the same way I can build it. We both have 2,000 sitting at the light. So, mm-hmm. you know, we have to... If everything works perfect, we both going to run good, but the light will determine who gets there first. Of right. course, the light and the tuner, right? Let's let's call it uh, the well, tuner. The tuner too. If you have a shitty tuner and you run a perfect light and your shit don't take off good, <laughs> it, don't, that, uh, it yeah, doesn't well, matter. Yeah, it's a lot of. You know? it's, it's, the car is it's all computer, so right. definitely, yeah. Do, so you guys everything both run Motec in both your, your builds? Both. We, both. Every, now, all yeah. our cars run Motec, yes. Yeah. Okay, so um, with your car specifically. Did you start with when you start with the Motec? I you, had Motec always. Really, always. Yeah. Even from the when you bought the car. It, no, the, it had it was on Accutech. Yeah. Accutech, Accutech. Okay. And it went to I put Motec in right away. I think with those Elite turbos that my first mm-hmm. you know thirteen hundred horsepower mm-hmm. was that recommended or you just felt uh, like you wanted more control over your car? Uh, honestly, I I really don't remember. But if I had if I was asked. You want to do this? It's going to be, might be better. Yes, we're going to do it. So yes. I don't remember exactly. You want to build the GTR? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. So that's, yeah. that's what happened. But all the cars previously um, were on Cyvex. Okay. Not mine, right. but all the mine. other team cars. Yeah, Not all, Cyvex. but most of them. You know, the yeah. first, like, you know, Mario's, Demo's, other red one he had, Caesar's, they were yeah, all on were. Cyvex. And mm-hmm. then we had like bad luck with them. Really? Just, no, no, mm-hmm. it's, I will not say bad luck. Uh, the computer it all comes down to the to the tuner. Right. What are you familiar with? So when, back then, it yes. was Cybex. Cybex had a good thing. Uh, working with Cybex and the car were running. Okay, then I think everybody started going different ways. And then we didn't have that perfect tuner next that, to you it's really and, it's really yeah. the That's tuner it. it's, yeah it's really up to the tuner if, it's up uh, to, the, to the person that is tuning your car right like and who do you feel comfortable exactly tuning with right like look at my porsche my porsche um emery tunes it from es motors uh aim performance built mm-hmm. it it's on cyvex mm-hmm. um i don't think there's any other porsche outfit that does what these guys do and it's on Cyvex. But, mm-hmm. you know, everybody thought when Motec came out with um, the computer for for the Porsche platform, the 991 mm-hmm. platform, everybody thought they were, you know, they are going to jump on the bad wagon and, and uh, you know, build some badass Porsches. But yeah. as it, it's all around, you know, the, the racing, that's not the case because 
the Porsche motors are delicate. They're not like the GTR motors. You throw, oh, throw another five pounds of boost. You throw yeah. another one pound of boost in a, you know, in a Porsche motor, you're blowing your shit up. <laughs> you know, it's not because it's, you know, it's a four piece block. Yeah. Again, like he said, it's up to the, it's up to the tuner. Yes, I personally think Motec is superior, but especially in the the Porsche platform, it's definitely not because it's not. We're not there yet. You're saying basically, we yeah. Have it's got. They have a lot of um, not. I don't want to see a lot. I take that back. But it's it's, still, it's, it's still, just been around R&D. more. That's all. Right. It's not that. That's all it is. You know, I just like Motec better for whatever. Right. It's it's you pretty know? common. A lot of yeah. people use Motec. But for the Porsche thing, is Cyvex has been around longer, and Emery's got the most experience. They have, you know, they build the, fa- you know. They have the fastest Porsches, whether it's half mile, the 60 to 130s, uh, quarter mile. It's just, you know, right. but it, that that comes with time, too. Yeah, right. That's what I'm you saying. Know? It's more R&D. We say T1 is the best, uh, you know, GTR outfit. Why? Because Tony's been blowing shit up for fucking 10 years, 15 years. You know, it, you don't yeah. just wake up. You're not born knowing you know what works what don't work right. it comes mm-hmm. with time you yeah. gotta push it to definitely. the limits yeah definitely. that's that's the yeah, truth definitely. you know it's not this it's not Decently. i don't want to say rocket science but not that it's not e- i'm not saying it's easy it's just the shit comes with you gotta put your time in bro right you yeah. know you gotta put your time in you gotta blow shit up because if you're not blowing shit up you don't know what works what doesn't yeah. work i that's mean true. that's that's facts whether it's a viper lambo gtr super anything you know that's how you learn. It's yeah, blowing, yeah, blowing sure. shit up. <laughs> blowing yep. shit up. So how did you guys come together? Where did where did Team Boosted come come from? How did that originate? I'll leave that to Caesar. Okay. To me. <laughs> to me. <laughs> you created Team Booster Racing. <laughs> we talk about how you, you guys talk about it. Uh, <laughs> all right. That's a good one. <laughs> that's a good <laughs> that's a good que- that's a good question. You're good, you're good, you're good. All right. This over a little bit. Okay. Because we had a different name before. So you want me to explain? You want me to explain where Team Boosted came from? Yes, you can. Okay, Why I'll not? explain. <laughs> it's okay. it's okay. So Caesar and the rest of them started Team Insanity. We started like 2015. 2015? That I got in, No, that I got into Team Booster, right? Uh, uh, team Insanity. Insanity. Yeah. I, I didn't okay. create it. Yet, All right. So anyway, part of it. so they was they were you know around for you know since 2017, I guess. I think it was 15, but regardless. No, that's whatever. Team Insanity. Yeah, okay. probably before that. They used, when, 14, when 15. Figure 2014, 2015. They were out racing. Um, but it started as a street racing team, or. Track like teams. we are now, a little they, bit of they, everything. Track. They, they used to do everything. Poconos. But, but just, when they started, it was the roll racing okay. fever that was yeah. starting where they started. So they used to do a lot of street racing, but it was in, in roll racing in the turnpike. Okay, Jersey. Are you, in New Jersey, right, yes. Right, Which is still, I think, I don't know if it's still a thing, but I, apparently We it is. hardly yeah, do bro. it anymore because the car, like I said, they, they became too powerful. Now right. you try to do it in the you crash it's dangerous it's right. very dangerous now but when they started they were making 1500 1400 wheel horsepower mm-hmm. and you know it was fun to do that we used to do the turnpike right yeah that's how i got to meet them and and i you got started. to that right so <laughs> they started um i'm gonna tell you now how how the team started and then i'll tell you how i took the torch over okay running these lambos so uh because i know that question's coming up i beat you to it so what happened was we had some internal drama a misunderstanding so on and so forth so that so that's how team boosted came up came out we had some internal drama everybody's cool now whatever was just stupidity whatever no problem so that's how we just transformed the name that's it it's pretty much the same people it was the same people they just some Again, just some internal drama, misunderstanding, just whatever. Um, so that's that's how we just changed the name. It's all the same people. Um, so that's that. Uh, but Team Insanity were the first ones to beat these Lambos. Which which Lambos? Which ones? Uh, the fast ones. The fastest Lambos? The fastest Lambos. The, yeah, world's the record-breaking fastest, ones. The world's fastest Lambos. The world's fastest Lambos. The record-breaking ones. Okay. So we, our <laughs> team was the first one. To beat them in the street on um, a youtube video on a, on a youtube 13, video 1320 video. video wow i can in show texas. you all yeah in texas <laughs> on the streets um roll racing it, right? roll racing in the poconos too 
you know, they came with an army of cars and we had one one car. Like, you know, we were like nobodies. Yeah. You know, with, with a little money and a dream, you know. And, you know, when somebody when somebody acts up, you want to be the one to reprimand them and put them in place. Well, that's how I guess we started. Yeah. And they came to the Poconos, right, with an army of cars and we had one and chopped them down one by one, baby. <laughs> How do you say? Yo. Whoop! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I got to give you respects for that because uh, I, that, you know, we talk about that a lot. Um, that's how. It, that's exactly versus, how it is, bro. Yeah. We're not shop cars. No, I'm saying a lot of these shop cars versus people, yeah. you know, in their own personal. And a lot of it is East Coast. A lot of East Coast yeah. bills that don't get the credit. I mean, you get it when you show it. But, yeah. you yeah. know, a lot of people talk about these shop builds and, um, you know, you have your own we, personal car no these are our personal cars yeah, there's no yeah, yeah. there's a big know, difference why do you think it's a shop queen you know because yeah. you know we're breaking shit of course we are you know right. so we don't have a shop car so i wish we did i are, wish yeah. guys i need some sponsors please if you want the gtr we community if you need want this going i need sponsors bro for real Me what too. more sponsors do you need you i mean you already have what what do you mean no i need sponsors to help you know this to help with what with what like rebuilds to pay tony's <laughs> bills bro <laughs> <laughs> they're not cheap they're not cheap so you have no sponsors no do you want a sponsor me do i want to sponsor the car yeah no <laughs> how much to put my sticker on the side i'll put it for free for the first year then we'll talk about the second year how about that <laughs> that'd be dope <laughs> So um, no, so really, there's no there's no sponsors. There's no sponsors. Not, Everything wow. is not even paid no by me and my cousin. Wow, that's it. Everything. Um, actually, I think I think I got a free pair of turbos from Precision throughout the process, yeah. throughout the journey of the build. Not Whoa. Stop! Don't get any <laughs> ideas. Discount it. Maybe nah, discounted. Hey, okay. Or yeah. maybe free. I don't remember exactly, but I got something from them. And yeah. thank you, Precision. Um, Tony is good to me. AIM is good to me with the Porsche. You know, they're fair. Like I said, I have no sponsors. We pay everything out of pocket. So does, he, so does the whole team. Our whole team, whatever cars we have, we build on our own. There's no, I mean, we're out there racing shop cars, bro. Like mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. with Different. oil money behind it. Not, <laughs> not trucking money and crane money. We're talking about oil money, yeah. you know, right? Definitely. So can yeah. you talk a little bit more about that? Like, what, like how you guys are able to afford these cars and, and be the fastest? The shops, bro, the shops are good to us. You know, the what shops, the are, shops good. are good. The shops are good to us, you know, like they, you know, obviously you're going to take care of a big name car, right? No, and he means also how can we afford it? Yeah, like what do you guys do for oh, a living? Yeah. Okay. Um I own a crane company. Okay. We do um we do crane rentals, we do a lot of work in the city. Uh, we have tower cranes, you know, mobile cranes, small cranes, trucking. Is this uh, like a union thing? Or no, we're non-union. Like non we're scabs, as the union guys would say. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're non-union. Um, again, that company also, we started, me and my cousin, by ourselves. Like mm. everything is, that's why we're so humble. Because nothing was given to us. Everything, whatever we have we is, it. you know? Yeah. How to work your money. You know, everything, we, what we have is from our, you know, our, you know, work, our back. We're working, yeah. you know, like we're not, you know, I'm not no trust fund baby. He's not no trust fund baby. You know, here, go. I own you you want to go play? Company. Trucking company? You know? Yes. So that's where, that's, that's how I can afford Self-explanatory. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's. And that, that goes with everybody in the team. They all have a business. Have their own business, right? Yes. And. I mean, we can afford self-made. Not that we're not for that the race cars. Not that, yeah. <laughs> so, so these cars. Nobody's are, rich, you know. Whatever no, we course, have, we're done yeah, by yeah. ourselves. No, that's all. No that's why everybody's on. humble. That's where you can throw a little bit of your tax money. That's yeah. it. That's what everybody does. And I mean, you can use the cars as a write-off. Exactly. The expenses. That's what you mean, right? That's advertisement. Exactly. We use the cars yeah. as advertisement. That's real. Yeah. Yes. Right. Yes. You yes. can. We were advertising. Legit. That's what I was yes. told by my CPA. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. yes. I, I have you the put, name you of take, my You take your company yes. and you put it on the car. It's, it's your marketing it material. Yes. 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 So is. I just wanted to make that clear. Plus. Nobody's doing anything. No. I was like, no, wait. That, definitely nothing. Yeah. Uh, I've been doing my business for over 20 years, so definitely I'm not doing anything wrong. Yeah. By now, if you were, I'm pretty sure. It's an issue. So your cars are. I'm not hiding anything. I'm not hiding anything, 
<laughs> oh, I, I don't know about you. But... <laughs> no, no, I, I, really, I was I was really talking. Oh, they can edit whatever they oh, want. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> so so uh, the car I think is... I need some time, Lose. I hit myself way too hard with that one. <laughs> <It's like repose. laughs> I need some ice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so oh, so the cars man. are actually your marketing material. So and exactly. you guys, yes. So it's a common yes. thing. Yes, um, exactly. Can we talk about the viral video of your car beating UGR's Lambo? Can we talk about the experience? How and, and you know, leading up to that to that point? Sure. Because that that run itself, if you guys, I'll put it up on the on the video right now. Yeah, I got to ask the question first. Go ahead. I got to ask the question oh, because boy. I, I want to know. We all in the team want to know what happened. Yeah. Why does it that he wanted to be on the ground so badly? From day one, I would love to know myself. And you really, why. he's he's really asking this because he really wants yes, to know. Yes, we all we want spoke to about know. this before. Oh, I really want to know. know. Yeah. We all want to I, know. I just, because he took it, he took it up himself. Yeah. Say, be, I'm going to I do want it. the torch. Okay. Why? We I want to help torch. you. Okay, we'll do it. No, but, actually, you were... No, actually, his exact words were, he goes, you're crazy. He goes, what's wrong with you? You're, you're calling out a shop? You're going yes. against the shop? Yes or no? Did yes. you not say yes. that? I says, okay, well, I got goosebumps. Look at this. Yeah. I says, I'm good. You watch. I do whatever I say. Yeah. Yeah. Whether I kill myself doing it, if I say I'm going to do something, trust me, it's happening. It's like it, it happened already. So say how so, those Okay, so how did it start? I just, you know, from Team Insanity, that's how they started. They started, you know, Effie um, was the one, you know, spanking them. Mm -hmm. So then, you know, Effie went on a little vacation. So I'm like, fuck, somebody's got to take over this. You know, this was. <laughs> so I guess okay. I took, right? I took, um, I decided I'm going to be the one. And luckily it worked out. Did you know you were going to do that? Like, was it intentional? Like, well, or you I, were, you know? I think you got to start from the first time you ran and you lost. I think that. No, 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 no. Let's make it very clear. Very clear. I never lost to UGR ever. I mean, if I did, please oh, show event. me a video. No, the event, the event, I think. That's not uh, okay. We had some technical issues. We didn't yeah, qualify. There, there was a, yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. but no, I never lost. No, that you didn't win the event. Okay, what's after right. that? No, but that's different. I but, didn't lose. No, no, but I'm trying I to say. I didn't lose. What's after? after that? That? I never <laughs> lost. No, no, to okay, UGR okay, okay. ever. Okay, okay, okay. But if I did, please show me a video. I, I would okay. be excited to see okay, one too. Okay, you know? okay. Right? The day that you did not quali qualify. Yeah. After that, no, you, it was before that. No, we beat. We smoked them. In 21, we got the Pocono record. We were building up steam. And then I it got started. It, so it started that. I got a little ahead of myself for 2022. Okay. And uh, it pretty much blew up in my face. I took all the heat. They were fucking making memes and making fun or whatever. But I took it like a champ. I didn't get upset. Whatever. Can you talk about exactly what happened? So we have some context um, behind it. Okay. So what happened? Um, typically, uh, Terrence drives the car. Right. And that year... Again, there was some internal stuff, and uh, T1 didn't want Terrence driving the, the car. So Texas Killer, my friend, um, drove the car. Uh, he was new in the car. It was, a, again, a new setup. We got lucky. At, I don't want to say lucky. We had no issues right. in 21. In 22, uh, we had a new driver in the car. Again, Alejandro did everything perfectly. It wasn't his fault by no means. It was just, just some bugs that weren't... You know, it worked out. In the Poconos, we had the ABS system was, you know, doing some weird shit. Mm -hmm. And in uh, Texas 2K and meet in the middle too. It was the, the, AB, the ABS system and then something in the harness because we put the car together, you know, since I had it, right? right? Not at T1, even when it was at the uh, command, that Mac shop. I'm, like I told you before, every event... The car was getting torn down, and I want to put bigger turbos and change this and change that. Obviously, wear and tear. Right. So, in 22, uh, we had an ABS, um, the, the ABS computer or ECU, whatever the hell it's called, it was fucking up, and it was just cutting everything out. Cutting everything out. The wiring harness was also, there was some bad connections or wires or whatever. So, in 23, we went back. 
and just took the ABS out because honestly, whoever's driving that car don't need ABS <laughs> to, uh, to control it. Plus, right. after I believe, what is it, 202, 203 miles per hour, the ABS don't work anyway. <laughs> wow. So, yeah, after after 202 miles an hour, what is it, 202, 203, whatever, whatever it is, right. it don't work. So, we just took the whole that that whole computer out and we connected all the the sensors to the to the Motec. Right. And we went to the Poconos, we beat the world record there by 10 miles an hour and then the track record we beat by 20 miles an hour. It did um 242 in the Poconos. 242 miles per hour. Yes, 242 in the Poconos. Wow. Um damn. That's yeah, I have fast. I have draggy <laughs> videos. I have you know all that stuff, but we started a little late after the start line, so that's why we only hit two thirty two when uh, you know when it was time when the, right. the race was over. But he, I guess Terrence two thirty two wasn't enough. He wanted to go faster, so even after he, it was over, the race was over. He still <laughs> wanted to go faster. Yeah. So that's that's that. So the bugs were worked out. You know, and it worked. You know, the car ran great. Uh, in the Poconos, we won obviously Texas 2K 23. And where was UGR at in, 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 during this timeline? Uh, they had the original record. I think was 223. We did 233. Then they came back. They tried to, I guess, beat our record, and they did 228 or 229, whatever 228. it was. 228. 228 or 229. Um, in the Poconos um <clears throat> so that was there any drama around this around, around this time with nah, it like I were mean, they was there any competition nah, any bro, we just, listen i don't i don't hate nobody you know i got no, of no course. i got, I got no it business, was right. actually he wanted to be the faster cars I that's just, it I just the faster cars were on the ground they were yeah i mean there's you know, no the, you know nothing there's, to do there's with no, personal yeah, there, there, it's nothing personal if you're the fastest i would have wanted to beat you if exactly. he was the right. fastest exactly. i would want to beat him it's not right you know, I'm going to go beat you who's slow. I, who cares? Yeah. You know, I want to. He I'll, just wanted to go out yeah. and beat the fastest. The fastest. Car. Plus, also. With I a wanna, GTR also. With, so with that a became GTR. Four, the, the right. you know, four <laughs> cylinders less. One, yeah. you know, one. Yes. Uh, a liter displacement smaller. I mean. Different I don't know. classes. Well. Different class. Di different. Yeah. Different yeah. classes. We're also. We also got a stock. Everybody says. You know the Lambo Assassin is a stripped down race car. It's it's really not. The only thing no. that's missing is the the back seat. I mean, Giddy, shout out to Giddy. Giddy came in twenty one after we won the first time, Texas two K, and he goes. He looked inside the car. He goes, I I thought this thing was <laughs> no, no bro. Car has we got everything. We got AC and everything. Very heavy car. You know, very heavy. everything. Everything was in there. So um, what started the journey from like a dig, like a dig racing car to a roll racing car? Because you guys were doing this up until that time when you broke the record, right? We were actually when the car was at Command Shop Houston. Mm -hmm. We used to when we used to drag race and roll race. Okay. Um, the specifically the the Lambo Assassin, but after um, I saw what was going on, like. I don't got money like that to, you know, go through two transmissions drag racing every weekend. I'm not especially No, listen, GTR. listen. They're very, they're very hard to drag race. Yeah, when you're when you're making, you know, <clears throat> this, you know, at this level now that the car makes, you know, 3300, 3500, right? Like, mm -hmm. you know, yes, Shep makes the best transmissions there, you know, but it's not a good setup for drag racing. Why do you think Mac went to a Turbo 400? Yeah, you know, you know what I'm saying. So that's why I don't drag race the car no more because it's too. First of all, it's too heavy. It's gonna be. That I gotta go race against George Dodsworth. He he weighs what? At least seven eight hundred pounds lighter. Mm -hmm. Giddy same thing. Mm -hmm. Maurice's car same thing. Mm -hmm. His car same, same thing. thing. Like yeah. where, where where am I going? I me I want to have glass windows. <laughs> yeah, you know, and I want to have power windows. You know, and. Right. And it's I'm gonna be put in a class where just I'm setting myself up for disaster. Why? You know? Right. For so, failure or disaster? Both. both. Okay. <laughs> I know it's kinda of hard for you to say failure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> failure too, yeah. of course. Failure. Right. You know, it's it, it's just too heavy. It's just 
you know i mean my my car has the same exact setup that george dodsworth's car like it mm. just it's the same exact thing just it's set just, up for different yeah places. it's just what is it 800 pounds lighter my car weighs 3650 i think dry you know with no driver wow and george's probably weighs i don't know 27 28 whatever three thousand i don't know whatever it is yeah. don't quote me on the the weights but it's it's at least 600 pounds lighter 600 pounds yeah that's a that's right a, i mean it's a big difference that's yeah. a lot of weight. that's a big difference especially to especially drag to drag race, race yeah. at those yeah. times that yeah. makes a big difference yeah, yeah. definitely so you you, you dyno the car as well right yes we dynoed it uh it has the dyno record for t1 um it made right under 2900 at 70 pounds of boost 70 pounds of boost 70 pounds of boost yes so on full kill what do you think that psi wise where would you be at 95 the most we made was 88 which was that race we raced the uh, ur in uh in GX texas 2K. 2k yeah mm -hmm. right I mean, that was 88 so that's why when that's why the horsepower numbers are all over the place because you really you pretty much guessed only it. 88 he's trying to say he has a little more room for yeah there's the this event right this is crazy seven so only more 80 <laughs> Se seven more pounds seven plus more we got a, a different set of turbos too going oh, on oh my god yeah pretty we got so there's yeah. still room to, to play with that record and still break that yeah. record that you currently oh. uh, have right now we're okay. looking up there guys just so you know he's got this fire ass photo um yes. it says gtr and it was the moment when they actually broke the record really good photo shout out to whoever took that photo yeah that's 1320 1320 1320 um, kyle yeah do you have uh, a digital Freddie. do you have a digital of that uh that we can i'm put sure up on the, i'm sure we can we can get it <clears throat> if you can get me that so i'm you guys sure can we see can it. i'll probably do a video on my phone but it's a really yeah. nice photo yeah super nice. super great shot yeah for sure. yeah. yeah tony surprised me that uh <laughs> with that yeah so yeah so we have the roll race record in for tx2k it's 237 and we did it with what is it 250 feet less track yeah Which the record crazy. before was 236 so we beat it by mile per hour with 250 feet less with less distance and four cylinders time. less yes wow definitely we gotta can't forget that four <laughs> cylinders. <laughs> so with this new set of turbos what are you expecting to do uh listen if we could do the same thing it's going to be impressive still um the new turbos will probably make they should make a hundred horsepower more each and they'll be more efficient um we'll see i don't want to say you know big things because that mm -hmm. you know the shit bites you in the face uh in the ass or the face yeah but you can say uh, it anyway it doesn't matter yeah. it doesn't um, matter if it happens <laughs> listen if we could just do the, um, honestly if we could just you know mimic the same exact thing i think we're in in good shape only because the way we won right you know i mean to beat that car bro it's i mean i didn't even I, what, what do i say so in that moment uh as a photo you were you were watching this happen yeah. you were witnessing happen so um we really can't talk about i guess the driver's experience because he's not here with us right yeah now, right so uh you mentioned terrence yes name? terrence, terrence yeah. was the one driving the car um can you just talk about what happened at you know obviously it's on video but for the people who don't know yeah, what happened. so i told so i told terrence i said terrence you know these guys are our friends and they asked me to give them the hit so i said just you know give them the hit they wait <laughs> why they said they said wait a minute. <laughs> i'm like wait this wait a minute. <laughs> that was a good i was one. like what so, so, so I said, terrence, no wonder I, I you could see that yeah so joke. i said terrence give him the hit you know they asked me if i could give him the hit make it look a little more fair <laughs> and uh and that's what happened so it's but, <laughs> say, if you guys see the video which you guys psych, see right now no, i ain't give nobody it looked like it he was like a it. standstill <laughs> That was nice. No, it was uh, a really, it was a really insane. Actually, your boy Mo told me to put Mo. that out there. So, yeah. <laughs> shout out to Mo. Which he, shout out which to Mo. Is, which which he, who was there too? He was racing. He too. was there. Which, too. if you see the race, uh, if you know a little bit about road racing, uh -huh. the left, the left side set the pace. Right. The right side mm -hmm. follow. Right. Or chase. You can never be in front. Right. And the race will never But this start. case, he was in front. I don't in know. In that case, the You guys right had side. to reset a couple of times, though, right? There not was on that. Not on that run. On the but one with the green light. Yeah. I don't know what happened there, but definitely. We'll see. It's going to be. Right yeah. The right lane, which 
uh, uh, setting the pace for sure. Right. Yeah. Again, I, I don't care to lose. Everybody wants to win. But I want to win. I want to lose fairly. Right. Yeah. You know, if you beat me fairly, okay, bro, you're fast. I'm coming next year. I'll, I'll try to beat you. But, mm -hmm. you know, when all these shenanigans happen and I mean, you really want to win like that? I don't. No, it's not. It's not fun. It takes a killer. Yeah, it takes a joy. Yeah. Out of right. Me. Yeah. Oh, at at the end of the day, you took the trophy home, but you were the bird that, you know, that didn't deserve it. You know, <laughs> I, I, I agree. That's right? the agree. drama with roll racing. You know, there is. But there is, it's a human person, I guess, looking at two cars. If he, he decided to give you a green light, if, if we both racing, listen, yeah. I got the green light. It's not my problem. Right. We can blame <laughs> it on the person that gave the green yeah. light. <laughs> that's that's how i see yeah. the road racing like right. i said is listen do the best that you can do try to you always want to lead first whoever mm -hmm. lead first have an advantage right but the person giving you the light is the person doing but all that's why we have rules so yeah you want to leave first but that's why we have rules like the left lane sets the pace yeah what, what, part, what are we doing over that, here that part right. we had to be in place, you, you know what i'm saying yeah. like yeah. yeah, you want to, you know, get the hit, so on and so forth. But but why do we have rules if... Yeah. Right? No, that's, that's you know? true. That's if true. that's the case, drag racing, I'll just take off on red, you know? <laughs> and I'll, yeah. I'll beat them. And, uh, yeah. You know? No, that's that's what it is. You got you to so, go by the rules. So and you talk about the, the setup in this car because it was mentioned uh, before <coughs> about you have some type of GPS to, to calculate oh, yes. wheel slippage which is which your car is not the only one with it i'm, I'm hearing uh, right but uh i don't know who i know both my cars have it my porsche have it has it and the gtr has it so is that integrated with the motec or? yes okay so what happens this gps system is this there's two kinds is uh, i guess a lower model and a more expensive model um obviously the more expensive model is more high tech it's mm -hmm. i guess the gps um is more accurate for the faster cars right so what happens with with motec right so the way they adjust um like the wheel spin yeah is they they see the front tires how fast they're going and then they check the rear tires so the rear tires so if the rear tires are going faster than the f the front ones mm -hmm. that means you're spinning so now you pull power or you know, whatever, error, whatever right, the right. tuners do. In my case, when the car spins all four tires, you really don't know how fast the car is traveling. So you don't know when to pull power, add power, because mm. you're relying on the front wheel speed sensors on the travel speed. But if the front wheels are spinning also, you don't know how, right. you, you know, and that's when you start blowing shit up, you know, you know, like definitely, you know, right. yeah. the car starts pulling timing. It just, it just fucks everything up. So is this, that why you get those like weird, is this only for road racing though? Or this is just, no, this is, this is for everything. For everything. Okay. Yeah. For everything. Drag racing. Uh, drag racing also. Okay. Uh, but it's more, again, the tuners, maybe I'm misspeaking, but I, I would think that um, it's more important on unprepped service because uh, uh unprepped uh surface because right. you would have more spin right right so but i might be wrong i don't i'm not a tuner but um so in this case we have this gps so now the motec tracks the tra the the speed that the car is traveling right via this gps then it you know it cross references the front wheel uh, speed sensors and the re rear wheel speed sensors, mm -hmm. and, and that you know, and the GPS, and that's how you know the tuners adjust power, put you know, pulling mm -hmm. power, putting power. Uh, but that's that's legit a big deal. In how much does this cost for for this to have this in your car for? I, it? Do you know? I think there's two kinds. I think there's one that's like. Four thousand, another one that's oh, eight thousand or something. That, that's that's an add-on as an add-on or with the Motec. No, as an add-on. You add -on. buy the Motec and then you add this GPS. There's two kinds, and I know one is double the price than the other. So and you got whatever one was the, the best most ones, of course. <laughs> right. uh, yeah, what's well, what's the point if you have the cheap one and it, <laughs> it doesn't read as fast as the car is right. going? Then you right. might as well just 
<laughs> go on vacation <laughs> with the four grand, five grand, whatever it is. Definitely. So you mentioned to me earlier about driving the car and how it feels and what your experience is. What was your fastest? You driving the car, what was your fastest uh, time? The fastest time, uh, not time, the fastest mile per hour mile I per went hour. Sorry, yeah. was either 226 or 229 I went. Wow. Um, it's... You just have to get used to it. You know, you're on 15s with, you know, in the rear with what? What do we put? 16 pounds of pressure, 17 PSI in the back, and maybe like 20 in the front. Mm -hmm. I mean, the car just, it dances all, it just, you know, after like 65, 70, it just, it just does this. You have to focus to look straight, you know, and make sure you're going straight because one of the first times I drove, driven one of these, um, it was probably making like 1800 I think, or 1700 the car I drove. And they told me, bro, be careful because, you know, you might think that it's trying to get away from you, but right. it's really not. That's what it does. And honestly, I never drove anything with 15s up until the gray car, Effie's car, in the Poconos. Mm -hmm. uh, <clears throat> excuse me. So you just got to get used to it, bro. You know, you got to yeah. feel confident, <clears throat> not com confident, comfortable everything is great until it's not because you know yeah. uh, the car the computer does everything till you break an axle or till i don't know something happens right. and something yeah, fucks definitely. up and then then everything is not great no more yeah. then you got to stay calm in there and just you can't panic if you panic that's the worst thing th that's the worst thing you 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 know you're gonna do it's just and you know? he, he he's a good driver. He's a good driver. I mean, if two he, he's hours, definitely that's, a good driver. That's pretty fast, man. I don't know if he's going to take the car this year himself. I don't know. Yeah, we'll so are you see. planning on we'll going see. to? Uh, I, yeah, we're definitely going to Texas 2K. With I, the car or no? With the car, of course. Okay. With the car. Uh, we got to defend the title. Mm -hmm. um, I'll drive the car on um, like the smaller events because I have no patience. I can't like, I can't be strapped in there, you know sweating it's hot as fuck the guy in front of you crashes then you can't go no more get in get out that, for me that's not fun at the end of the day yeah, you bro, have to have patience for that yeah at yeah, the end of the day cool. it's my car i paid for it whether i drive it or not it's my car you know what i'm right. saying like whatever I, I got nothing to prove to nobody mm -hmm. you know so definitely going this year we're going with uh we're, we're going heavy part. actually this year really? We yeah, we got in. actually we got a platinum sponsorship. We're gonna be right next to Shep and T One and all we, the big boys. We bring in all the cars from the team, so everybody's coming. So we're, hopefully, we're expecting you to defend the title, right? Yes. And you're also gonna try to. Do you see yourself yeah. breaking that record with these new turbos um, at Texas 2K? Because this is also a different. Listen, this is in a different track race here, right? It's yes. a different track, but right. the distance is gonna be the same. It's okay. just as good. Jason Miller is gonna prep. Uh, you know, the Dallas yeah. Motorplex, uh, so. like he's done in the past, the guy's okay. the best. You can't, uh, but you know, we, we don't know if it's going to be a better track or worse track. Um, who knows? Uh, but they're not too far from each other, yeah. I mean, so it should be the same. They're both big tracks, right? I, I yeah. can't imagine. I think for the event itself, uh, Dallas might be better because I spoke to Peter and I think he said that the, the actual, um, the track itself like the property is bigger yeah. mm -hmm. so that's what i heard too yeah, yeah it's bigger whoever hasn't been to tx 2 k it's my first year going go so, yeah. and, <laughs> and after you yeah, what, go what do they say the super bowl of, of racing street car racing street you know? racing yes super world bowl. cup was nice though world cup yes. world cup of course. is super bowl of drag racing okay Yes. TX2K is Super Bowl. No, they're just two different events, bro. Drag race. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, you're saying you see a lot more street racing you cars see there. More, or street more street cars. 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 Exactly. exactly. Like our cars from our team, right? Correct me yes, if I'm wrong. Yes. The only car that can be competitive and it has a lot to do because he drives it is mm -hmm. the Hulk. Yeah. You know, for import versus domestic. It's We're, the only fully drag car that yeah. we have is my GTR. Everything else is a street car. Okay. His is the only one that's light enough. We have Lambo, enough. RA, GTRs, everything in the street. Porsche, it's just they all the street cars. Right, right, right. They all the you know, cars. they're yeah, they're all the uh, yeah. The only they, car that has plastic my, windows is the Hulk. Yeah. Everybody else. Yeah. Has you know, 
Power windows, heated yeah. seats. You could drive it to the track, yes. race, yeah. come home you with could. it. I, don't, I mean, I don't know if we're going to drive home with it, but <laughs> we could definitely drive to we the track. We can make it to the track. The coming track we're going to make. Yeah, we're coming back. We're going to blow it up. 50-50, I don't know. <laughs> to, keep, to say the best. <laughs> so are you, have you ever been in this situation where you did blow something and had to repair it like on the spot? Or your the GTR has been pretty good to you? Uh, we've Both of you guys, yes, actually. We've yeah. swapped no? the trans. Okay. Um, at the event? At the event, I, we blew a turbo back when I had the 7685s in the stock location. And we had a turbo to swap it out. But since it was at the stock location, you're not, you got to drop the motor. And we're yeah. not. Mm -hmm. So another reason that we went to the front mount turbos is because you have a turbo issue. You could, you know, pull it swap out. Swap it right in yeah. there. Um, we uh, do whatever we can. Wh whatever but we, we, can. we don't come like with an extra motor. We we're not a shop. Like I said. Right. His car is... Has a we come, his shop is, is behind it though. So T1 is a very prepared yeah, uh, we have, shop. They come with a lot of extra stuff like everybody else. If like, we can change something, borrow from somebody, we will do. But like I have broke, me personally it. in my trailer for, for the GTR. I come with a spare transmission, spare turbos, uh, pretty much spare everything minus a motor. But I have a spare fuel pump, dry, uh, axles. Uh, yeah. Uh, drive shafts, injectors, yeah. coils. I mean, small you, stuff. Yeah. You have to. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? At this level, you know, if you don't come with extra parts, just stay the fuck home for real. <laughs> I mean, there's no. <laughs> now that makes know? sense. You have to. Yeah. And we all yeah. have. You know, there's. We have. You know, most of the cars are like GTR. So whatever is going to work on my GTR is going to work on Caesars. It. They're pretty much. Mm -hmm. You know, the injectors, the, the spark plugs, but. Like I said, I come with pretty much extra of everything minus a motor because you're, you're not, you know, you're not changing a motor. Are there people who do that at the track, though? Oh, change yeah. motors? Yeah. ATRs, yeah. 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 Uh, Shop Houston does it. You know, Mac does it. ETS. Uh, ETS does it. AMS Performance. They have AMS. a trailer yeah. set? Or they do this outside and then, like, in a, in a uh, They come prepared. That's crazy. They, I mean, Mac, Mac does it outside. In uh, um, an event like, like TX2K yeah. and... World Cup Finals. World Cup, you, they come prepared to do that. Yeah, it's yeah. a five-day event, so they, they do come prepared. Yeah, like you have to, you have time, right? To, to to change it, you know what I'm saying? Like 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 import versus domestic between rounds, right? Mm -hmm. You know, if you're a little lucky, you could swap a motor. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, a GTR motor. I'm saying, right? You well, could. You could if you could do that. I'm sure you could. Do yeah. Anything no, else no, is no, we're ready remember, to do. Yeah. Remember the. Um, the rotary next to us yeah. last year they would change the motor every round it was a rotary yeah every, every round, round. Yeah. the motor is yeah. like this big they would pull oh, it out if, if you build a dry car you're going to make it easy right? exactly they, they get prepared for exactly it. yeah. it's gonna like you know caesar's cars yes it's a drag car but it's not we haven't thought it, that far no into, it's not it's not it's still like gtr we you know what i'm saying right. component from a gtr yeah all the components are gtr yeah. components it's got yeah. you know the the motor the trans the yeah. I mean everything the subframe is, everything is still GTR, yeah. yeah it looks like a drag car but at the end of the right. day if you want to put it back together with power windows you can you could yeah I mean it'll take a while but I forgot to ask you before how many G's do you think you were pulling or your car was pulling on that because <clears throat> I don't think the draggy is pretty is is it accurate with I, the amount of G's I mean, you're pulling because at that at the that number power. that I'm going to tell you is from a draggy so it pulled two um. 2.0 at 100 miles an hour, it I think. It said 2.0. Yeah, yeah. Said, but I don't know if that was like yeah. accurate. I mean, yeah. I we could check the MoTeC. I never thought, I never really asked Tony, but so it pulled 2.0 at 100, 101, 2, 3 miles per hour, whatever it was. And then it pulled 1.3 Gs at like 200 miles an hour. You said 100 and, 102 it pulled 2 Gs? So at, no, so at 102 miles an hour around, don't quote me, around. I don't know the number, pulled like 2.0, 2. 2 point something. Insane. I would never get in that car either, ever. <laughs> no, the workhorse guys, uh, Tony, he was trying to, like, oh, we'll take you for a ride in one of these cars. I'm like, bro, no, nah, man, mm. I'm good. And then at 200, <laughs> 200, again, don't quote me, 201, 202, 203, it pulled like uh, 1.3 Gs. So you just pulling it the whole way, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, it was spinning. The, it was spinning the tires in like two hundred miles an hour. It spins the front tires at two hundred yeah. miles an yeah. hour. It's, it's it just yeah. It's stu It's pretty stupid. Yeah.
I have a video. Actually, I'll show you a video after when we're done. Yeah. Baldo, actually. He put a GoPro on the tire. I'm sorry. Yeah. The front tire. Uh, underneath. The back tire was. The back mm -hmm. tire, the, it was It was all wrinkled. That Like, how much, How many? How fast were we going? I don't even remember. Is there it an was, in car? Is there an angle of, like, the driver from, like, yes, facing at the driver? Because yeah, yeah. I, I can't find that um that angle. I only see, like, like facing the... Ubaldo's got to get him to you. Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because I heard something about... Is there a scramble button in the car, too? Yes. Okay, so that We button, never hit that. You never hit no. that... So we on that on that run, you never hit the no no no. Wow, we never hit nitrous. Uh, it's got up to uh, we got different jets on it, but we I have them. Uh, that's another thing I carry all the time is the jets. So we have a uh, one hundred fifty shot, two hundred shot, I think, and a three hundred shot, but we never sprayed it. Ever. So not even one time. <laughs> so <are> you, <laughs> what yeah. the hell, dude? Yes. Yeah. It's okay. Sitting in there. If one time he feel like he's losing, just give it it. <laughs> so there was no nitrous. No, 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 no nitrous. And nobody believes it either. No. Nobody believes it. Damn. Then in the Poconos, like the Poconos was the best. Everybody said, oh, this video is fast forward. I'm like, no, stupid. Look at the G's. Look at the G's. Yeah. You know, and that's when I really noticed the G's and actually pulled because I never, I just never looked at it. Yeah. But then everybody was saying, oh, this shit's fucking uh, fast forwarded, whatever, sped up. That's whatever what I look at. I'm like, yo, that car is, yeah. <laughs> to be in that car must be It crazy. looks fake. It really legit looks fake. You know? That's what I saw. I saw, I woke up one morning and I saw it and I was just like, actually, I think I was in, um, I was in San Diego when I saw that uh -huh. video at IHOP and I was scrolling and I'm like, there's no way this shit's real. I watched the video like 10 times back. And I was like, there's no way in hell this car right? is fast. And then I started reading and I'm like, oh shit, that makes sense. He has all that all that power. It yeah. has to be, but it, it looks fake. Yeah, it, it looks does. like it's sped up. Yeah, afterward, it goes, once it hits, I think, fifth, fourth or fifth gear, I forgot. But it, ju it just legit looks fake. It looks legit like somebody spraying nitrous, but there's really no nitrous. And your driver is just chilling. Terrence yeah. is just chilling, yeah. driving. He's not, he doesn't get out shaking no, or anything. No, nothing. Like, he got shake. He was. He came out actually shaking a little bit in twenty one, when he almost hit the wall in Texas two K. He was yeah. ah. he crossed lane a couple of times. Yeah, he almost hit the wall. I think three times doing that, like two twenty five. I think two twenty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, pulled the shoot. He pulled the shoot. Strained, yeah, but it strained up. But he still had a. He had to put some uh, effort in there. I gotta see this. But there, he, there came, a video he that came too? out a little, you know. That toughened him up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. It just you know, and I remember Joe from Maine goes to me. This guy is going to go in there uh, again and do this all over again? I said, I guess, Joe. I'm better <laughs> him than me. <laughs> so um, we were speaking before, and you guys mentioned you had some type of event you guys were invited to in DR. Can you talk more about that? Yes. So when was it? Last year in uh, import, versus the, import versus domestic. Uh -huh. um, Yassier from Cleaner Studios. And who else was there from that? Yeah, on 2022, not last year. because 2022. Okay, 2022. so 2022, um, Yassier from Cleaner Studios in DR. Okay. They invited us um, to go. To the to, Dominican to, Roll go, Race. Go ahead, because I, I don't remember the To the Dominican exactly. Roll Race, like I said. Uh, you guys wanted to come to the Dominican Roll Race one? Are there fast cars and, in and DR? It, there is some, but definitely not at the level of the U.S. Right. But, but uh, there's some fast ones for real. It wasn't. It, it was. Uh, we took the invitation. And said, "Okay, let's go." We brought four four cars. Four cars. It was Leo's, okay, uh, GTR, right? Leo's Lambo, Lambo. the white one. Mario's, Mario's R8. And Mario's GTR. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and Mario's, Mario's GTR, GTR. Yeah, the red GTR. How yeah. did you guys get the car? Like on a we, ship or something? We or? shipped two containers. We How long did it take to get there? Uh, seven days. Not bad. Oh, okay, not bad. Yeah, we took them. We trucked them down to Miami, right? We from drove, Miami. Yeah, we, we trucked them down to continue. Miami, and then they went to. What, is it? Would there ever be an issue where like you get car gets stuck like in at customs or anything? Like no, that? no, no, okay, okay. no, no. Everything was super. Smooth. The car's got to be paid smooth. off, but you can't have a yeah. lien on the car, so yeah. the cars has to be paid off uh, to ship them out. You yes. can't. You know, okay. if you if you're leasing your car, you can't ship it out to be, then, ship it out of the okay. country. Period. Forget <laughs> it. Not, not just. And the then other. the event over there in the Dominican Republic, they give you a permission for like two three months, right? For you to, you can even drive it in the street. Really nice. So so, yeah. so talk about the event. Did you guys? How'd you guys do at the event? It was it was something like TX2K, but in a small, a small way, smaller version. version. 
it was really nice. The atmosphere. I mean, there were cars from Puerto Rico, from the U.S. and the Dominican, and wow, it was one really of my nice. actually one of my favorite events. I, it was really that really sounds nice. like a vibe. It's very it's like very, different different I'm countries. You, yeah, yeah. Different. For what the atmosphere is a lot. It's a lot more fun than here. How's the, the temperature though for racing? Oh, it, beautiful, beautiful. It, it was not beautiful, but the humidity, <laughs> the humidity is not the same. It is hot, it's, it's hot, warm, it's, but yeah. it's hot, it's good, it's the, good. Yeah, uh, the humidity, the, the humidity not is bad. not like here, exactly. Okay. Yeah, but it was hot. Um, but I was, bro, I was so impressed for like considering the resources they have, yeah, that the event that they come up with is absolutely. Phenomenal. astonishing Phenomenal. like yeah. it's organized and everything organized very nice. Very just nice. and then we end up taking the uh, the Kodoma record for a gtr there which is what uh seven six we seven, went six. they had seven eight i think he wow. was driving their the car so no, their record. no no for the Kodoma, leo 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 drove oh, it. Leo. Okay. leo drove it he broke the record seven six which, which the gtr what did you win with the with then the, i was driving mario's r8 mm -hmm. I won the road race event over there with it. Uh, Leo took the European faster car in the track too. So we took basically every record they had over there. <laughs> wow. It was really nice. It was really nice. But I'm sure I'm sure they were like super nice. They were super chill, right? They oh, were yeah, like, no, yeah, bro, I'm telling you. Was it very competitive no. though at all? Or? Uh, they, no. they, there was competition. They were, from what I understood, right? Because I'm Greek, they're all Dominican. So, mm -hmm. they, I, so from what I understood, there was way it was way more competitive in the lower class, yeah, like the slower okay. classes. Yeah, in the lower. In 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 yeah. the higher classes, because all, I mean, all our cars make what two thousand plus at least. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, in in the high, you know, in the faster classes, it was it wasn't. I mean, there was a few cars, but right. it wasn't as. Mm -hmm. um, deep as this you know the slower cars but yeah. listen at the end of the day it was legit entertaining it was they're, they're super really nice. hospitable from um, mm -hmm. from there we were invited now to go to puerto rico with the so same cars because you guys won that yeah. event they it, it was so rico. nice they invited us to a road race event in puerto rico i think it. it's because the the following we attracted correct yeah from DR or just in the States? From, uh, from overall, everywhere. Everybody. Overall, I think we... Overall, overall. you know? Um, yeah, so what did you guys do? You shipped so they, two they cars They shipped the car from home? DR to Puerto Rico now. We two only, two cars. just two. We just took the Leo Lambo and Mario's R8, and we went over there and we won that event too, <laughs> in the road race, and then yeah. we shipped the car back. In here. Puerto Rico, I didn't I didn't go to Puerto Rico. I just went to DR, was, but it was, what an experience. I'm telling same, you straight up, bro. Really nice, really nice, really nice. It was so did nice you guys, you guys have any footage of this? Any video yeah, of this? Yeah, we have Well, everything. the camera, we I do, don't know what, what the camera we guy do, was We do, we do, we do. We got very, very good video. Why do you say that? Why do you say that? I don't know because the cameraman is all in all our videos, and while he's supposed to be making films, <laughs> <laughs> it's, I think he, he's up there too, right? He, he, yeah, 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 he's, yeah. Up, <laughs> he's up there too. He, so the he, I think he puts the camera in auto somewhere. I, think. <laughs> he, I, I have no idea. <laughs> I, I think he's working on something on like autopilot or cruise. I think he's got <laughs> Tesla cameras that they go by themselves. You know. The camera guy got flown out, and he's like, literally, he breaks the record, and the camera guy's standing right next to him. Yeah. That's like, well, yeah. where's my footage, bro? But it re it's really nice. We have a, a team with a, a group of friends where we're really nice guys, like you said, and we love to race. We've yeah. been to a lot of events, and every time we go, we win something. We have something. We to better celebrate. win something, or we go, or we go with know, a lot so of cars. If we don't, really if we don't win man. at least one thing, I don't know. Yeah, it's the not team horse is horse racing or something, <laughs> donkeys or. It's a very nice team, man. Like I said, we go to every event, we we'll have fun, enjoy, and, and compete. That's it. I mean, we all grew up the same way. Everybody's yeah, right. humble. Yeah. Everybody supports each other. Nobody hates on nobody. Yeah. Uh, it's just we you know, whether my car wins or Caesar's anyway. car wins, mm -hmm. we won. The yeah. team won. Right. It's the team's car. Yeah, okay, it's under my name. I pay the bill, but at yeah. the end of the day. It's got yeah. boosted racing on it. Right. So yeah. it's a you know, nice atmosphere. You know, so, some people, they like to, uh, you know, compete against their friends. That's not the case here. You yeah. know, we're, you know, we're one. So um, I have one more question. I actually have two more questions, but 
I'll start with the first one. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. So, um, as you know, Dan Rue, Dan Rue had mentioned to me yes. before uh, when I met you that, uh, or you actually mentioned that he was staying with you at yes. this, uh, Florida 2K, FL 2K. Right? FL 2K, yes. Right. Um, and you know there's this whole controversy about him racing a Hellcat. What is yes. your take on that? Do you feel like Hellcats <laughs> to, can't to, compete To with all my two demon guys, cat guys, <laughs> uh, track court guys, there's no hate, bro. It just, you can't compare. I'm sorry. It, it's not going to be fair. Dan Rue's going to fucking drag your ass. I'm, I mean, to, to say to say it nicely. No disrespect, for right. real. It just, come on, bro. Look at, look at the times these things do. They just, you know, and I want to add something. That's why everybody hates GTRs because they hate it. Why? Because they just work, you know, and it doesn't look like anything special. I mean, let's be honest. It looks like a Honda Accord Coupe. But mm. it's fast, David. and it works. GTR, is about you know, fast. they're not Very the GTR is a supercar. Does it look like a supercar compared to a Viper? You know, a Lambo? No, mm. it don't. It, it looks like you know somebody's you know midlife crisis <laughs> car. You know that that's that's what it looks they like. Very fast. Those but they mean, just work, those bro. Those mean that a Hellcat will not be the race. It, I mean, no, anybody listen, can it can still race. happen. Anyone, yes. right? Anything can happen. In if the I have yes. a Hellcat right. and I want to race a GTR, I will go race it. I don't give right. a fuck. But I mean, statistics, but, you know, nah, you know, you look at, you know, on paper, it's not going to be fair. But of course, racing happens. Of course, a Hellcat could be the GTR. But yeah. whoever's a better driver, yeah, whoever. whoever's a better whatever. driver, whoever's car it works the in car that moment. works the moment. Right. But a race, if, you can race anything. If everything, I don't care if it's a GTR or Lambo. Of course, race, yeah. race. but right. if <laughs> everything anything. is perfect, the you know the driver don't mess up, the car doesn't blow up, the car don't spin, mm -hmm. the GTR is gonna win every single time. Yeah. It just if everything is perfect, but I'm not saying you know a, a Hellcat will never beat a GTR, mm -hmm. but especially in the my street. opinion, yeah. right? <laughs> especially in the street, all wheel drive is real drive. You know, yeah. That makes sense. That's a fair take. Yeah. I just wanted yeah. to get you guys' opinion yeah. on that. Yeah, okay. um, and then also this past week, I think it was Cicio's R8 has a 60 to 130 record that, on the street, right? Yeah. Yes. That so, thing is moving. It's moving. Yeah. So are we going to see any like any like anybody else that's going to be that record anytime soon? <clears throat> um, on our part, I don't think so. I'm hearing some riffraff that that people are going to you know, go out um, to try to beat it. I mean, that's a... That's a big number, bro. And now, if we decide that we wanted to do that, that's not in our list right. to do. <laughs> it's not a goal about, for you guys. But yeah. we definitely have powerful B10 to go and do it. Oh, of course. Sure. We definitely we can. can. It's but just do we want to go take the chance and try to hit it and maybe lose control and kill you? I mean, <laughs> or not? I'm not into that, like I said. But <laughs> for us, it's not that important. It's if, not It's okay. not that. I mean, it's, I legit totally respect it. I mean, that yeah. thing is fast as fuck. Very fast. Like, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> on the street. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, it's so it's it would do a better impressive. time. You think on the on the track because of the prep? Technically, actually, it should. Th that's it a should. that's a good question. I personally don't think so. Only because those cars, you can you, when they're on the track. Yeah, and they stop. You know, obviously now they're not spinning. Mm -hmm. The front wants to come up. Mm -hmm. so how much f it's yeah I see me I mean. personally i don't think maybe it'll go a little faster but like you could only like the gtrs you could put more power down on the track because you know the yeah, motor is in the front yeah. the trans is in the back you know they i personally think they're just a better platform for going straight but mm -hmm. the r8s you see all these r8s making like look at amy's car at the DCT World Cup last year, the thing was pulling a wheelie at the eighth off a no, it yep. was drag race mm -hmm. uh, off a like. Do you know That's what I'm saying? Crazy. So yeah. I don't know. Will they go faster? I mean, I don't know. But how much? But how much faster are they gonna go? Right. There's only so much power they can, you know, put down, put put down, ground, down yeah. before the nose wants to come up. It's just right. physics, mm -hmm. you know. Um, That's fair. But I don't know. 
But, but again, that's my opinion. Maybe I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, but that's what I think. <laughs> well, it's your opinion. It's yeah, that's the whole yeah, point. You know, I just wanted to get your guys' opinions. No, but I know, you know, sometimes, oh, this guy doesn't know what he's so talking about, this, that. The There's going to be a lot I, of that. It's of probably, course. It doesn't matter what course, guest it is, that's people why, are always going to see But that. that's why I say that's my opinion. Right. So maybe, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know, but that's what I think. <laughs> you agree, Caesar? I agree, too. Cool. All right. Well, um... <laughs> Yeah, I, I think I think you I guys have. pretty much answered all my questions. I think we covered pretty much most of what we should have spoken about in regards to your yeah. car, what's yeah. expected at Texas 2K. Um, I'm excited to see it in person. I've never seen the car in person. I know uh, your photographer mentioned that he took a ride down the street to put some, uh, not gas in the car, it was like oh, car wash. We, we went to the car wash. Yeah, to which get is detail. pretty like he's, where else, I gotta, what, what should I say? World's fastest GTR or? I mean, no. Not one, world's fastest. One of oh. one of the world's fastest cars Fast or GTRs. The, the fastest GTR. roll race GTR. The fastest the roll planet. racing GTR. Tooks, don't on roll the planet. your eyes because it's going to get you in trouble with these people. You say the fastest <laughs> oh. GTR, and yeah. You, you what know? do you? Like I said earlier, what do you guys think? You put will, it in the comments. Put below. in the comments. What do you? Yeah. What do you guys yeah. want to call it? How about yeah. that? And if yeah. they say it's the world's fastest that's GTR, that's what we're going to go by. And then I'm going to say, ask Tooks. He said that everybody said. They will need to argue with Giddy and George. Uh, and let's not forget the <laughs> let's not forget the CEO John Odom. Exactly. Oh, well, oh, I yeah. forgot. That's yeah. Right. yeah. Now, but that's not that's that's a whole different. I mean, I spoke with Workhorse about that. That's so just like a different car, right? Yeah. Is it considered a GTR? No. Technically, no. Yeah, right. the body. The body, right? Yeah. But the I think glass. Yeah. Apparently, he's just a, he's trolling. He's trolling. Yeah. It's it's just for content. Okay. But he's <laughs> that's what that's what I, that was, that's what was said to me. I'm not saying yeah. anything. That's not my yeah. opinion. Yeah. That's just what was said to me. Okay, you, let's make that clear. Jukes, you're learning, right? You, <laughs> you follow my footsteps. That's what Very they good. said. That's what they. That's uh, what they said. Um, but yeah, I really, I really appreciate your guys, your guys' time. Thank, thank you, you for so coming, much. bro. Thank you thank for the thank hospitality. You for Everybody that I've been interviewing has been so nice to me, man. So I really appreciate it. Um, and we fed you too, not like it, everybody else. <laughs> no, you guys, yeah. We got yeah, pizza course. and chicken rolls. And now we're, after we're going to wrap and up drink. quick, we'll go eat some steak. Yeah. yeah. Right? right? I never blame that on anybody. I always try to, my best to, to make sure I eat <laughs> before, you know, I'm doing I'm the, I'm the trying yeah. to make it, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. So, um, but yeah, thank you for the food as well. No problem. Pause. Um, <laughs> <laughs> thank you for coming. <laughs> so tell the viewers where to find you guys so they can check your guys' content out. Uh, um, so... I go by Lambo Assassin right. on Instagram. Uh, Bo team Boosted Racing is our team. Mm -hmm. It's on uh, IG as well. Team Boosted Racing. Team Boosted Racing on Instagram. Uh, Lambo Assassin. Lambo Assassin. High Tech GTR. High Tech GTR. Our camera people, what are our Instagrams? Ubaldo. Yeah, super. Leo, camera guys, video guys, super cool. Mario GTR. Ubaldo, what is, what is it? Ubaldo. 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 Ubaldo 2. Ubaldo 2 and... You put the you you gonna put the JD Papa. On, he's gonna the put, we'll put all. We'll put it all in the description. We'll put it it. I will for sure. They got weird names. <laughs> they crazy. The guy. The blah blah blah. <laughs> Just team boosted racing, please. That's team boosted. <laughs> well, there you guys have it. We uh, wrapped up this interview with uh, Thank team boosted. Thank you for having us, bro. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Make sure you guys like, share, comment, and subscribe. Keep listening on all streaming platforms. And until next time, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Later. Woo!